Governor Oboriwori, in his speech, cautioned the chairman to reside and operate from their area headquarters to reciprocate the huge mandate given to them. He charged them to discharge their duties with sincerity of purpose, impartiality, compassion, fairness, justice, and to work for the actualization of the more agenda. I urge you to reciprocate the huge mandate that I'll be giving to you by giving preference to the needs and aspirations of our people with a view of delivering good governance. We should address the recurring problems of insecurity, poverty, unemployment, and environmental decay and in your local government areas. I implore you to have regular meetings with security agencies in your areas of jurisdiction for the purpose of maintaining law and order. As a third tier of government, closer to the people, you need to improve the environmental sanitation in your communities. Governor Oboriwori also reiterated that the state government does not use local government funds and welcomed the Supreme Court's ruling on local government autonomy, emphasizing that statutory allocations to the local governments in the state for the last three months are intact. I therefore expect you to hit the ground running by backing on visible infrastructure projects that can be commissioned. Don't think that because the money is there, just go there and do the usual way. It's not really possible. So you must make sure this money are put in, they're put in use. He further advised the chairman to improve on their internally generated revenue but cautioned against overtaxing an already burdened populace, reeling under the painful effects of the current economic hardship. Oboriwori stressed the need for them to work seamlessly with their vice chairman, the legislative arm, and other critical stakeholders in their local government. Responding on the behalf of chairman and vice chairman, chairman of the Oshimle North Local Government Council, Innocent Esewize expressed appreciation to the governor and elders of the PDP in the state for the opportunity given to them to serve at the grassroots level of governance. We said that we have adopted the more agenda across the 25 local governments. I want to assure you, Excellency, that this chairman will listen and respect our leaders, who will be loyal to our party, the PDP, and above all, your excellency, we will be loyal to you, for your boss. We will ensure that the more agenda we hit every nook and cranny of the central local government of Delta State. So, who much is given to much respected. You are giving us more and expect more from us. The high point of the ceremony was the administration of oath of office on the chairman and their deputies by the governor. Charles Kosipri for Quest News.